and welcome to this month's STEM Workshop Challenge. I'm so excited to be here with you to share the magic of science. So today I'm going to show you three magic tricks and all of these magic tricks use the science of light. So while we're doing these magic tricks, we're going to be having fun exploring and experimenting whilst learning about the science of light. So for these three magic tricks, all you will need is a jar. The bigger the better really, and it needs to be round. Any coin. Pen and paper so that you can make yourself a picture or an image and some water and that is all that you will need so first of all I'm going to show you a magic trick where I'm going to make this coin disappear okay so first of all I'm going to get my coin I'm going to place it on the table and then I'm going to put my empty jar on top now I can still see my coin here and you should be able to too so when you do this magic trick, you can do this with your friends and family and they will be able to see the coin through the side of the jar. And then I'm going to make my coin magically disappear. And I'm going to do that by filling the jar with water. As I fill the jar... There we go. I now cannot see that coin anymore and you probably can't too. Now, why does this happen? Well, to be able to explain that, we need to talk a little bit about light and how it works. So right now, I've got a light above me and that light has a bulb, light's coming from it and it's going down and it's reflecting off that coin. Okay. And when it reflects off that coin, it's going towards the camera. When I do this, the light's coming down in a straight line, reflecting off my coin, and it's reflecting into my camera in a straight line. And when you see this in, in person, it reflects into your eye and it's always travelling at a straight line but when I put my jar full of water over the top of it water is doing something to that light it's bending it so the light that hits the coin as it travels out the water bends it so it doesn't go into the camera and it doesn't go into your eye so right now I can't see that coin because the water is bending the light and it's travelling not into my eye. And that process is called refraction. So this magic trick works because of refraction. The water is refracting the light and it's bending it away from my camera so you can't see anymore. So there's my first magic trick that I can do all because of the science of light. My next one is going to need a picture. Now I've got here my rainbow and my rain cloud and my sun. And I've done this so that I've got two different pictures, one on the left and one on the right. Okay. And when I place my image behind the jar, about 30 centimetres behind the jar, watch what happens. So I've got my image, remember where the rain cloud is, remember where the sun is. Can you see what's happened? Can you spot a difference? When it's not behind the jar, when it is behind the jar. Fantastic, yes. So when it's behind the jar, it's flipped. The image becomes flipped. And that happens because of refraction too. As the light reflects off my picture and travels towards the camera, 
the water is in the way. As the light travels, the water bends it and he starts travelling the, in the other direction. The light reflecting off my sun goes towards my camera. It goes into the water and it's bent and it goes that side. So the light is swapping sides. It's becoming flipped and that is because of refraction too. So my final trick I'm going to have to use a different camera angle for. This is magic trick number three. So you will see inside my jar we have a plastic bag with question marks on it. As we lift the plastic bag out of the water, it reveals my secret message. If I put it back in the water, my message disappears again. Wow! Isn't that absolutely incredible? And there is no magic going on here other than the magic of science. Light is being refracted through the water which is making the word stem miss my eye as I lift my message out of the water the light is being reflected off the paper and into my eye and I can see the message. As it goes in, the message is being refracted by the water away from my eye. But watch this. All I need to do is move and I can see the message again. If I move my camera to this angle, it disappears. So the reason this happens is because the light is being refracted by the water. It's being bent to making it change direction and not be able to travel into my eye again. If I move, I can see it. So I'm going to show you how to make this really quickly. Super, super simple. All I've got is a plastic bag. And inside it, I've got a piece of paper. On my piece of paper, I've written my secret message. This time it's STEM, but it can be anything you want, or it can be a picture. And then I've put my paper into my plastic bag and sealed it so that my paper doesn't get wet. And then on the outside of my bag, I've written my question marks. You don't need to um, write anything if you don't want to. I've just done question marks to add an air of mystery. What you could do is you could draw an outline and then colour it in on the paper so that suddenly your outline becomes filled with colour. You could write secret messages. You can do anything that you want to adapt this magic trick. Have great fun exploring and experimenting with light to do some really fun and really easy, simple magic tricks. While you're doing it, you're learning all about the science of light. Have fun! <laughs>